Oof. Wake up. Come on, Jackie, wake up. Everything's okay. <laughs> His darkness comics. Did you see that? There you go. You're out of it now. What up, Vince? You fell out of the bed. You well Look at that. Tonight, Jackie. Hell yeah. Your meds again, bud. So good. Uh, uh, we've been through this, Jackie. No answer means no, I didn't take my medicine. <laughs> RTX on. I don't understand what's happening. Is your this RTX on? This is hell. Okay, that's a new one. This is the darkness, isn't it? It's some kind of trick. Come on, Jackie. Don't hey, ravioli's too spicy! <laughs> Just in <laughs> Dude, that's got to be a t-shirt. But I know you get confused by all this. These bad dreams are a part of being sick. That's fucking awesome. Let's get you well again. I tell you what. Side splitting comedy. Entry before breakfast and I'll tell the doc you had a good night. Away from the light. Bring us a safe and bring us a safe and everyone in the mansion come to the dark silence is its tongue. Oh, wow, Jenny, I'm sorry. I don't want to lose you. Like RTX on. All right. Oh, you work here. You, what can I do for you? Just calm down, Mr. Walker. Mr. Walker. Shit's getting spicy. As spicy as my raviolis, man. Security. What up, flat top? What's up, janitor? He's regressed into a more complex cognitive disorder. His thoughts are becoming extremely disordered. People always see value in what they don't That's understand. Right. Always see value. That's why. Hey, Jackie. I got the thing you wanted. It's big. Johnny, talk to me. What is all this? Some kind of darkness trick? That's what I told them, but they wouldn't believe me. They got bad wrists from all the computers. I tried to get your rocket in here, but it was too big. That's why I don't go outside no more. Johnny, you gotta help me get out of here. You think there's some kind of secret key to everything, Jackie? It's Tuesday. You take your medicine and then you get your meatloaf. God damn it. That's me, dude. I don't feel right. In my head. I think I'm not alone. It's too bright here. I agree. We need to keep watching. Because something's going to happen. It'll all be clear in the end. Can you see straight? I can't see straight. I think that light bends. And sometimes it goes around corners and here comes Jerry he's on the 10 yard line he breaks the tackle 20 yard line 30 40 50 60 100 it's a line drive to center he's out in the paddock area with just one man to beat goal 1600 men dead and no one knew of their fate none survived this was the story of the charge of the light brigade tune in next week for more of their adventures the fuck is up with Johnny, yo? And you are the focus. It wants chaos. My hunger for blood. Look at this guy. That was, that was weird. You're weird. Yes, yes. Run along now. All right, so let me get straight. He He's says he lives in a big mansion. The eyes are too place. close together. No. Come on. Tell me something. Anything. We're working on a plan to escape this place disguised as a band-aid. Yeah, but we're not sure if we can pull it off. Thanks for nothing. Disguised as a band-aid? Hey. hey, you. Who, me? No, not you, asshole. Him, the one with the hair. I don't have any hair. According to my RTX on. Is that it? That's what it. I want a cigarette. I want a cigarette. I want a cigarette. What up, Tony? I already had a nap. Tony, please, tell me you know what the fuck is going on here. Lima beans are spies. Fuck me. Confirmed. Hey, got any fruit? How do you like them apples? I like fruit. Alright, this fucking guy's no use. Larry? Larry. George? Larry. George? Larry and George. Hey, that's a reference to uh 
No, is it a bit? Is it To Kill a Mockingbird? What the fuck is question mark? I don't know. How are you today, Jackie? Naked. You should really remember to take your medication. Mm hmm What's your name? I can tell you hmm? missed bath time again this week, Jackie. What's your name? I can't get your name. But that's not your card. Who are you? That's not your card. Why don't you go play socialize? Yeah, that's what, what I thought. You should not really not to kill a mockingbird. I'm an idiot. You have a great day, Jackie. Don't talk to me, I'm retarded. I killed you. Dr. James is waiting, Jackie. No. Jimmy. Oh God, no, this way. Dr. James is waiting, Jackie. I hope I'd see you this morning. Oh, Chief. Dr. James is waiting, Jackie. Thanks. Thanks for the third time, my my buddy, my bro, my homie. No, no this ain't real. <laughs> no fucking way. Yeah, yeah, doctor. Thank you. I've heard from your nurse that you're getting worried about your medication. Is What's up, Grape? Do you understand why you take the medicine, Jack? I'm not crazy. This is just an illusion. If you know it's an illusion, you could make it go away. Uh. But we've had this discussion before. You can't make it go away because it is not an illusion. Mm -hmm. You see what's happening, Jimmy? The darkness is inside our heads. You mean the voice you hear, Jackie? The one that makes you do bad things? Does that seem reasonable? It makes me do good things. Look, I'm not going to skirt around the issue any longer. Dr. Vic and I are concerned that you're making up new rules as you go along. All the evictions fine for television, but not for real life. You're not the head of a crime family, Jackie. You're a patient in this institution, and we're trying to help you get well. There is something wrong with this place. You're not keeping okay, me here. Jackie, let's just stay chill. Dr. James is trying to help you. Shut the fuck up. Hey! <laughs> you're upset, but I'd like you to use your quiet voice now. I no longer wish to speak to your darkness voice. Fine. Let me out of here. I gotta take a walk. All right. Nobody's stopping you. Edward, take him to see Nurse Jenny. Come on, Jackie. Just try to... Yeah, sure. Whatever you say. I'm gonna go hit on Nurse Jenny. Chief, what up, brah? Get out of my way. Get the fuck out of my way. Stop pushing me. I swear to God. Oh, we're going this way. Uh, I thought that was Nurse Jenny for a second. Hi, Jackie. Hi. What up, Leo? A lot of improvement in you, Jackie. Well done. You wanna go smoke some crack out back? No. All right. It's a reference to the comic books. Jackie, I'm so glad you're back on your med cycle. It's a very positive sign. Wait. This would mean she's a nurse practitioner. That's actually logical. Dr. Vic's been asking me about your progress. He's very concerned for you. We all are. Jenny, I don't know what this place is, but I'm going to get us out of here. Why would I want to get out of here, Jackie? I work here. I'm here to help you. No. No, not you two. Not you two. What the fuck is happening? Just stay calm, Jackie. It's going to be all right. Now, last time we talked, you were telling me about the delusions you've been having. You said you were the head of a mob family and that your house was under attack by men trying to steal the darkness from that you. That wasn't a delusion. That just happened. I know it did. They sh they didn't change her model. Her arms are all sliced up still. You gotta listen to me. I think this might be hell. And we're trapped here. I'm gonna get us out. I can see why it seems like hell to you sometimes. But it's just a hospital. I want you to trust me. Everyone here is trying to help you. I don't know why this is happening, Jenny. You were dead. 
I saw you die. We talked about this, remember? When you don't take your medicine, you have a hard time separating fiction from reality. You get a lot of bad dreams when your serotonin's out of whack. <laughs> it makes you think you're remembering things that never happened. But my family, my, my friends, the darkness. Jackie, none of this is real. I'll work out a schedule with Dr. Vic. Play your cards right, and we can see a lot of each other, okay? Jackie, you okay? My schedule? What? Jenny, you don't understand. You're in real trouble. We both are. We're getting out of here. Now! Jackie, whoa, no. whoa, big guy. Code white! <clears throat> Easy, Jackie. <clears throat> Let go oh, of me! God. Come on. You were doing All right, so here we go. Good. Easy, easy. Calm down, Jackie. We're not gonna hurt you. Keep him still. Geronimo! Johnny, cut it out! Go. Johnny, what Two. the hell are you doing? Sleep. Get him off, would you please? Run, Jackie! Get Run back here, Jackie! Alright. Head for the bunker! He Tell must Eva I've been relayed! Head to the bunker! He's running for the door! Jackie, get back right. here! This way. There's nothing out there for you. So what do you guys think? Which one's real? See, as long as the bloodline continues, the darkness will always have a new host. Found that out my fifth birthday. Woke up in the middle of the night with my dad just sitting on my bed, hovering over me. Butcher knife in his hand. <laughs> Still not really sure if the crazy fuck was thinking of putting me out of my misery or making sure no one else would take his place. Ooh, that's a good stop, point. Jackie. Jackie, Jesus. I can't believe it. You're back. You said the darkness won't let you die, but I, I never believed you. It took it four days to repair you after you got shot in the face. Oh, I'm losing my fucking mind. <laughs> All right, man, I'll but be here. Jackie, I don't uh, know how to tell you this, but uh, they arranged the funeral for your Aunt Sarah today. God damn it. God damn it. It's my fault. It's my fault they killed her. It was that prick Bragg. After he shot you, your Aunt Sarah, he, uh, uh Jackie, uh, I'm so sorry. Jesus, it's all going to shit. Your boys beat the Brotherhood back, chased them out of here. But you know that wasn't the last of them, right? We can't let the Brotherhood take the darkness, Jackie. That's not going to happen. The darkness. The darkness has Jenny's soul. And it wants these Brotherhood jackoffs dead and the siphon for itself. If I don't play ball, it says it'll keep her forever. Jackie, that siphon in the darkness's hands, it's not good. It's too powerful. With the siphon, it could overwhelm you. Take control completely. I don't have a choice. I won't let it hurt Jenny. Jackie, let's uh, let's take a step back here, okay? Let's let's think about this. So, what if? What if she isn't even real? The darkness plays tricks on you, huh? It makes you see things. No, it's her. I know it. I feel it. So. What are you gonna do? I'm gonna go to my Aunt Sarah's funeral. Then I'm gonna go kill a lot of people. Be careful, Jackie. The Brotherhood will stop at nothing to get the darkness. Nothing! So we'll kill them. So these are the relics I'm collecting and what I've missed. This is, well, it's a thumbscrew. I don't really know what else to tell you. I mean, this thing is definitely giving off dark energy. But again, we're talking about a device that was used to torture people by slowly crushing their fingers. I'd be scared if it wasn't giving up. Think back to your high school history class. Wait, did you even go to high school? You know what? Forget it. I don't want to argue, nor do I want you to punch me in the face. So I'll just catch you up to speed on. I don't want you to punch me in the face. It's funny. All right, let's see what we can. Bye, 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 bye. Darkness bullet sounds like a cool toy. What up, Chief? Hey. Well, hey. Good to see you back on your feet, boss. Someone's gonna pay out their ass for this, Jackie. You just point the way. That way. That way. My RTX is on, yo. Hiya, Jackie. Good to see you back. Those fucking weirdos tried to drag you off. But we were able to turn them around after we took so many of them out. 
We just couldn't get to Aunt Sarah in time. Frank, I'm sorry about Eddie. You did the right thing, boss. Nothing else you could have done. We're gonna take care of his wife, though, right? Of course. We'll look after his family. Thanks, boss. That means a lot. Yeah, that was kind of fucked. Ooh, that's kind of fucked, too. He's just chilling there, too. Ooh, here we go. The one time Nigel finally takes me out, they destroy the place. Gonna need more than me to clean up this mess. Yeah, shut the fuck up. A good housekeeper knows how to organize this time. You guys, I'm gonna explore this real quick, if that's cool. You don't want to go up there, kid. Nothing you need to see. Ah, oh, fuck, Jimmy. This is all my fault. Occupation We're going up there. Son. I'm just... I'm just so sorry about your aunt. Are she you? was one tough broad, you know. Cut that is today. weird gate. We should get down there soon. Yeah. Let's go. If you like the uh, stream, please give it a share. RTX. Um. All right. I thought I had my Steam notifications turned off, but I guess not. Place got fucked up. Big time. Firefighters continue to comb through the rubble of the defunct Lucky Mannequin Company warehouse. The building burned to the ground in a four-alarm blaze earlier this week. Investigators believe the location may have been popular with squatters and are looking into whether the blaze may have been caused by a faulty generator they had been using. Workers say the search for bodies has been hampered by the sheer number of mannequins still in the building. That's fucked. Divorce can be hard, long, and sometimes a bit. <laughs> That's fucked up. Oh, wow. That is so cool, though. I love PC so much. Jesus Christ, Jackie. What the fuck? <laughs> I'm sorry about what happened to Sarah, Jackie. You did what you had to do. That's why you're butcher. That's disgusting. Okay. You go pay your respects now, Jack. Jackie, boy, are you a sight for sore eyes. I'm really sorry about what happened, Jackie. What? It's not your fault, dude. Whoever these fucking pricks are, they are gonna pay. All right, we'll do that. The fridge is fucking loud. All right, y'all, let's go to that funeral. I feel like we're going to get attacked at the funeral. Like a no respect kind of thing. Boss, we're ready to head to the cemetery. Just say the word and we're gone. Time to go say goodbye to Aunt Sarah, Vinny. You go ahead. I'll make sure the boys are ready for you when you get there. Is it gonna skip it? Or are we gonna get when a cutscene? <laughs> running numbers for my cocksucking Uncle Paulie. I used to kill time at Rocco's. Real shithole of a bar. But the waitress, biggest tits you ever seen. I'm pissed drunk this one time, and I hear someone call my name. Next thing I know, five goons are stomping my head in. Fucking assholes put me in a hospital for a week. Two people sat with me the whole time. Jenny and my Aunt Sarah. My last day there, when I finally healed up, and Sarah leans in, slips me a piece of paper. It's got the names and addresses 
of the assholes who put me in there. One look and I got the lesson. I wasn't gonna make the same mistake those fuckers did. Finish what you started. Uh oh. Eleven twenty-five. Hey, Johnny. Jackie. None of this is real. <gasps> Here you go, Jackie. Spoilers. Come on, Jackie. Let's you and me head up. The church put on a beautiful service. Yeah, they did it right, didn't they, Vinny? You bet. Top shelf all the way. Classy. Little long, but you know us Catholics like to talk. <laughs> That's all they do. <sighs> you know, boss, we're, we're all thrilled that you, uh, you, you got your thing back, but, uh, you know, some of the boys are thinking maybe this hit has something to do with that, and, you know, well, no disrespect, but... Just spit it out, Vin. You know that ain't no one's gonna back you up more than me, Jackie. Just give the boys something to go on, okay? Well, not for nothing. You spent four days in the back room with that crazy prick Johnny when by rights you should have been dead. We just want to know what we're up against here, you know? Let's go up. I mean, in all reality, he has no idea really what he's up against. See you back in one piece, boss. I tell you, it wouldn't have been the same seeing your Aunt Sarah off without the old Jackie Estacado. I mean, this is just a sequel to... I mean, if you really think about it, it's just a sequel, really. I mean, the origin story was Darkness 1. I'm sorry for your loss, Jackie. Thanks, bro. I like the clouds. It's really pretty.